Hey guys, so uh, the next topic as part of this unit kind of gone over uh, Maya, Aztec, and Inca, and then conquistadors and conquering the land and the encomienda system. And now we can kind of talk about what's called the Columbian Exchange. So the Columbian Exchange is really in reference to uh, the cultural diffusion that occurs between natives of the Americas and Europeans. So that particular brand of cultural diffusion has its own name, and that is called the Columbian Exchange. And the Columbian Exchange has a lot of profound impacts, and that's what we're going to take a look at today. So hopefully this one should go relatively quickly. So uh, just for posterity's sake, the Columbian Exchange is the exchange of ideas, uh, crops, technology, goods, uh, diseases also between Europe and the New World. Um, Recently, New York State started referring to this in an official capacity as the encounter also. Uh, one year on the region's exam, lo and behold, uh, they asked a question about the encounter, and no one had ever heard that term before, so no one knew what they were talking about. So New York State decided to just change the vocabulary around this topic without telling anyone. So moving forward, you may see this uh, topic referred to as the Columbian Exchange, or you may see it referred to as the encounter. Either way, um, we're talking about the same things. And it's important to understand that uh, the Columbian Exchange has both positive and negative outcomes. So what are some things that are kind of exchanged? Um, plants and crops that are, you know, plants and crops that are domestic to the Americas and not found in Europe are, you know, the Europeans learn them. Okay. Uh, the, one of the best examples is like uh, potato. For example, potato is very, very scarcely used throughout Europe until the Columbian Exchange. And then uh, the Europeans start to recognize some of the value in potato and um, kind of use it uh, en masse. They're exposed to corn, etc. cetera. Um, so it's what is this interaction between natives and the Europeans? What are the natives learning? What are the Europeans learning? What about this is hurting the natives? What about this is hurting the Europeans? And that's really what this is about. And uh, just to kind of remember, this diseases piece is one of the most important facts that you will learn in this unit. We need to understand that 90% uh, of the natives that die off as a result of this, they die off as a result of disease, not warfare. Okay, so that's an important part to understand. So what you guys are going to do, you're going to you're going to look at five different documents. You're going to look at a map. You're going to look at um, a couple of different documents about weapons and diseases and some other things about the Columbian Exchange. And it kind of acts as a stations activity. So as you go through each document, just make sure you answer the questions associated with that document on the worksheet and submit it via Google Classroom. And as usual, I'm around if you guys need any help. All right. Later.